Hypothermia in animals. Pets and other animals can suffer from hypothermia and should be protected from the cold. Some animals such as polar bears, penguins, and seals are typically not affected by the cold and do not suffer from hypothermia. The polar bear avoids any chance of hypothermia thanks to the fur that consists of an insulating undercoat. It is this fur, not their fat, which prevents polar bears from suffering heat loss, and adult males will even overheat when they run. Another species that is not related to the polar bear is the water bear. Water bears, also known as tardigrades, are water-dwelling micro-animals that can survive freezing or even boiling temperatures. Water bears can even go without food or water for more than 10 years. Water bears are normally made up of 85% water and they will dry out to only contain 2% water. They have the ability to then mysteriously rehydrate without damage to their cells. Water bears produce a kind of sugar called trohalos, which replaces the disappearing water in their bodies. The sugar is thought to form a gel phase as the cells dehydrate. Penguins are another type of animal that is not bothered by the cold due to the fat layers on their bodies. When penguins incubate their eggs, they bounce the egg on their feet, keeping it warmly covered under a pouch of fatty skin under their belly. The penguins' feet also stay warm due to blood vessels running to and from the feet, which facilitates countercurrent heat exchange. Seals are another animal that is not affected by hypothermia. Seals have a thick layer of fat which provides a natural source of insulation and helps the seals survive in cold water. Seals need to maintain a consistent body temperature with being exposed to changing water temperatures. Seals have blubber and blubber contains blood vessels which helps keep the seal warm. Wow, it definitely looks cold outside. I'm sure you can feel that cold clear my bones. It's a good thing for me, I have a penguin suit to keep me warm. Wow, my feet are really cold. Obviously a penguin's got better circulation than I do. This video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.